Hey guys, I'm back, and this is what I would say is the best video of artistic book reader so far in 2020. Because in this video, I'm gonna create a bookmark, and I really, really like bookmarks because I don't know, it just lets out your creativity into a paper, and then you can read it, use it while you're reading if you're like in the middle of a book and you can put it in. And it's not gonna be one of those fold it and do that bookmarks and put it in there it's gonna be a very simple paper bookmark which will look sort of like this this is half finished i need to write an inspirational quote on it and there are many many inspirational quotes from thomas edison and people like that and there can be there are also little notes there like positivity messages that you write it and then later on when you use the bookmark you're like uh, you're the best and you can do it i believe in you so it just brings out your it just makes you feel nice inside or you can always look up a few quotes and look them up from your favorite scientist your favorite artist or something like that from Vincent Van Gogh or something like that so yeah you can do stuff like that and now I'll teach you how to make a bookmark in four simple steps very easy very fun so step number one in creating a very simple bookmark yes is taking your paper as you can see I've done a few markings there and I've folded my paper and put a few markings they're very very light so I can create this effect that looks like brick sort of and color it up like like this so use these markings to color the paper and once you've colored all of it you have to just cut it out like this so it's gonna look a bit like this it's sort of like a jigsaw puzzle right now so you need to try to figure out which what goes where and yes all that this is a bit confusing <laughs> now that i've done stuff on it so once you've done this part jigsaw puzzle part art jigsaw puzzle piece it goes like that and um stack on there and this is very complicated. <laughs> That's that way. Yes. Yeah, it sort of goes like that. No. Yeah. That goes here. So this is how my little paper looks right now. Went before it was cut, and then I cut it out like that. And now that I've cut it, I will take a wet tissue paper, like. Not like a wet sanitary tissue paper, like wet wipes and all. I'm gonna take a tissue paper and wet it. So I have a wet tissue paper here and now I'm gonna pick one. Now, since this one is already half wet, this one, not that one, that one's already completely full wet. This one isn't that nice because I just wiped it up, but this one's gonna be a bit better. So I'll just squeeze it on like that and try to spread out all of the water everywhere sort of like that now that your water is pretty much spread out almost everywhere it's all gonna smudge up and it's gonna take a while and it'll look a bit like that all over it looked very very nice and now that i'm just gonna let this dry and send a few images at the end of the video to you guys now that i've done this i'm gonna write an inspirational message on it so I still have a water here, a bit of water left. I'm just gonna leave it on. This is very hard. Mm, squeezy, squeezy. So now that I've squeezed it up, I'm just gonna let this dry. And if I were you, I'll use a tissue paper. I have tons here. And um, not tons, it's only like two to three. But yes, that's a lot. And use this to soak up the extra water for like a minute or so. So the extra water is gone. And I'm gonna take this, it becomes very hard. As you can see, this one's already partly hardening. But if it keeps on getting wet, it'll just stay soggy. Now I'm gonna write an inspirational message on it. So guys, my inspirational message is gonna be something that Thomas Edison said once. It's, I have not failed. I have just found a thousand, 10,000 actually, that's a very big number, ways that won't work. It's by Thomas Edison, and I wanted to be a scientist when I grow up. So I really like that quote, and let's write it.
Write in your best handwriting. Now you can use this from any way, from here or from here, but it looks a bit clearer from here. I, trick your spellings, have just found 10 comma thousand ways that won't work. Now you don't need to write who wrote said that, but I will. If you don't have space, it doesn't really matter, but I have tons of space here. Oh. Uh, So now my bookmark's made, and I really, really, really like it. And I'm going to show you a bookmark, uh, images on my other bookmarks right in a few minutes. And the more of these quotes are going to be in the description box. And I hope you really like them. You can always search up your own quotes. And I hope you really, really, really like them. So guys, just for extra safety, I'm going to put a bit of tape on it. It's sort of like lamination, except it's not lamination. If you have lamination at home, you can always laminate your piece of work. But if you don't, you can always tape it up. Try not to put those weird thingies that come in tape if it's not an even. But if it comes, it does not matter. It'll still look very pretty. In fact, it'll give a very sweet effect. Now I'm going to tape it up and show it to you. Later in the video. Thanks, guys. Bye.